Good morning from our very cute cabin here in La Lager, I'm pretty sure it's pronounced. Lager right by Lake Mivitan. Um, I'm going horseback riding today and I love horsies, they're so cute. I'm super excited for that and of course we're gonna go see some other cool things as well like the pseudo craters, um, the volcanic formations, but for now it is so peaceful out here. This is making me want to just be like a cottage girly, farmer girl, typically a city girly, but man, this is just, this is something else, guys. All right, we ate breakfast and now we are ready for the day. Here's my outfit. I just got this scarf in Reykjavik and I have this white rain slash wind coat on from Uniqlo. Just a plain white tee under. I have my nice linen pants from Anthro and my Air Forces. Let's go! We're going horse All right, first stop is Holdi. I believe it is a spot with a bunch of volcanic formations so it's supposed to be really pretty I've seen photos um, so yeah the drive is only about 35 minutes from where we are not too bad because every day we've been doing like two hours so today's a little bit lighter on the road which is nice I appreciate it and we got to sleep in today which was beautiful so let's hit the road We have made it to first stop of the day. Let's go see what Half D is about.
a lot of fun. Um, it was more horseback riding than ever before. At some point we were right next to a cliff and I was like, man, I've really put in my whole life. It's another day in Iceland. I had to stop vlogging yesterday because I don't know if you can tell, but my eye is super swollen. I am high key allergic to horses, but I am in denial because they are super cute. But I'm super sad to be leaving this Airbnb. It has been so peaceful, so wholesome, so cozy. I will miss it, but we are heading to our next stop. It's called Iglis Iglisador. I am totally butchering that. I'm pumped for the rest of our trip. Just so unfortunate that the horse back riding caused an allergic reaction to my eye. But see you later. I'll be back. I will be back here for sure. It's so peaceful here. Bye, River. You've been so good to me. Love you. Also, I'm wearing my puffin sweater today that I got. I love it so much. And today we are actually going puffin hunting. Not literally, we just want to see them and take photos and videos for memories. We're not gonna actually hunt puffins, obviously. We did try puffins on the first day though. All right, let's hit the road. We made it to Stugwagil Canyon and something good to know is that they have bathrooms here. And bucket list in Iceland at it right now. It is incredible. At it right now. Guys, honestly, as I'm walking back to the car, I feel like a fool because I had Paris and London and Amsterdam, places like that in Europe on my bucket list forever. And Iceland was kind of this random thing where we were like, let's go to Iceland. And now I feel like a fool that that was not my top destination because it's actually just incredible. Y'all, we were just right here.
like this nature bath because they give you free tea and there's an egg chair which I am thoroughly enjoying. This spot is cool because it's in the middle of a lake but it's not super hot and there's random algae floating in the water but I honestly really liked it. You can also jump in the lake if you want a bit of a cold plunge and then you can have some tea after and this one's really good, it's blueberry. The official puffins hunt is starting right now. We pulled over on the side of the road because we saw people taking photos and this area is supposed to be known for like a lot of puffin sighting. Um, I believe we are in an area called Bakrigoy. It's on the very east coast of the island. So let's go see if we can spot any puffins. Wear my puffin sweater for this. So we gotta see some puffins. All right, apparently these are puffins, but I feel like, I don't know, you can see them right here. I feel like we can get a better sighting of some puffins. This is a beautiful spot though. We can do better, let's go to our next spot. Oh, puffins, where are you? Come out, puffins. Okay, we are at location number two and somebody just confirmed that there are thousands of puffins here. Here's our next Airbnb. I'll do a quick little tour. It's really not that big, but you walk in, got some chairs, you've got my twin bed, you've got the main bed here, and then you have a bathroom. Pretty simple. The kitchen is over there and we'll have breakfast there tomorrow morning. We have made it to the end of this vlog. I am so ready to go to bed. I am feeling a little bit nasally right now, so a girl took some Tylenol cold. Hopefully it kicks in tonight and I don't think it's gonna be anything serious. God, please let it not be anything serious because I want to enjoy Iceland. But if you have been enjoying the Iceland vlog so far, comment down below your favorite destination from this vlog and subscribe so you can keep an eye out for my next adventures. Love you, thank you for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye.